that is how you should be doing recycling. Different types of glass into different types of canisters. That reminds me of doing trash back in Taiwan. Everything is organized like into details. Breakfast is Switzerland. Never disappoint. All right, today I'm gonna to do the same thing. Using the 15 to 35, but shooting everything at 35 millimeters. So all the street photos you see today is gonna to be a 35 millimeter. Using the 15 to 35 is a huge setup. It's definitely not ideal for street, but I don't mind it that much. Especially in a busy street like this, nobody really cares. there almost hopefully okay never mind that's that's pretty cool actually easier exit on the way down right in the middle of the I don't even know what's that called really cool stairs so I was told there's a garden right behind this door let's go check it out Wow, this smells incredible. My goodness. Very, very in Zurich. Can definitely check out that garden. No one's there, no tourist knows about that place. So I was just there at the Water Church and um, there's there's a couple exhibitions, well there's two. I don't really understand. Well, one of them I do kind of with the film and then the other one I just don't. Yeah, I just don't get the other one. But there are two windows that's, uh, that has pretty good views of the street. Exposure here with the empty filter 1000. Let's check this out. I have this at 13 seconds, F14, ISO 100. All right, got, I actually got a boat in there, so it's pretty cool. But this is not a 35, this is actually a 20, so let's see what it looks like at 35. Okay, I can't really see much at 35, so.
was not exactly street photography, it's more like a, I don't know, like cityscape, landscape, long exposure, whatever you want to call it, but I think this angle is pretty cool, so. I'll be using ND1000 again for this one. Six seconds with ND1000, F14, and then ISO 100. I'm gonna also turn on two second timer to avoid handshakes. All right, let's give it a try. Well, I feel like the 35 is still a bit too tight. The the, the focal length for this bridge, well, or this, is around like 24-ish. I feel like it looks a lot better than 25. However, I feel like whenever I'm taking photos vertically of this church, it looks better at 35. At the end of the day, it's really just how you position yourself and the kind of focal length that you like to use, honestly. Photography is all about composition and I feel like I'm actually kind of lazy using the 15 to 35 because I was able to just use like 24, 25 instead of 30 all the time and I'm not moving that much so it's probably one of the downsides using a zoom lens here. 